Hi everybody, this video will discuss the settings and options found in the RTO slash VET settings tab of the system settings page. This section is where you will find settings related to training and reporting of a VET Mistata. The first setting to look at will be the LEES note type field. This relates to the sending of learner engagement and employer satisfaction surveys through Accelerate. This field, the next setting in this video, is the Add a VETMIS Required Details by default setting. This is an ease of use setting to enable for RTOs and relates to the contact update page, which can be seen in a later video of this series. Enabling this will have the VET related fields as standard for contacts. The next sections are specific for Victorian and Krikos RTOs and relate to reporting and management of these specific contracts. If you are an RTO operating under these circumstances, your onboarder will assist with any further setup questions you may have. The next setting to look at is the Issue Certificates Only If Paid option. This enables the issuing of certificates to be dependent on whether the linked financial details of an enrollment have been fully paid. Not having tuition fees be completely paid will block the issuance of certificates. The Avetmus reporting fields must be complete and accurate as they will appear on any NAT files exported from the system. You must also ensure there is a contact linked as the RTO contact for certain Avetmus fields to appear. The USI field is for your OSKEY device key details, which is different from your user key. We have a separate video on how to set this up. In summary, this video has discussed some of the key fields in the RTO slash VET settings of Accelerate. The next video will discuss the registration form details.